The events in Odessa during Holy Week in 1871 were the first to be widely called a pogrom in Russian, and the events of 1881-2 introduced the term into common usage throughout the world. Numerous definitions of the term have been proposed by scholars and dictionary publishers, but use of the term is inconsistent. Research into pogroms frequently requires consideration of the precise meaning of the word. Werner Bergman writes that there is as yet no consensus on terminology here among researchers, that there has as yet been little interlinked research into pogroms and that pogrom research has not yet focused on distinguishing pogroms from other, closely related forms of ethnic violence. A number of other scholars, such as John Clyer, Henry Abramson, David Engel, Paul R. Brass and Neil Pease, have discussed the consistency of the application of the term and the implications of its usage. The term is sometimes used as a generic term in English for all forms of collective violence directed against Jews, however usage of the word in this wider sense has been disputed.